and today I'm doing a bikini haul. So I know what you're thinking. Ali, it's almost November. Why are you doing a bikini haul now? I know, I know. I've actually been trying to film this video since August when it was still summer-ish, but regardless, keep in mind that I do live in California where it's warm like all year round and there are such things as hot tubs. But either way, I ordered a ton of swimsuits from Zoffel.com because they're all under $15, all the ones that I'm going to be showing you guys today. And you really can't beat that, especially because these are good quality. So that's why I'm showing you guys on camera. So right now I'm just gonna say 18 plus warning if you don't want to see me in a swimsuit because yes, I know, oh my gosh, I'm actually going to be trying them on on camera. But otherwise, that defeats the purpose of this entire video because you won't know what they actually look like because me holding them up isn't going to do it justice at all. I am in no way a model trying to showcase these items. I'm honestly super awkward and everything. I was just spinning around. But hey, I'm a real girl with a real body. I don't have a perfect body. I tried to pick out bikinis that I thought would look good on everyone. Honestly, if I can rock these, so can you. I tried to get a variety of different types. I did order a medium in all of these because typically I a large in tops and a small in bottoms and you had to order them as like a set but they actually fit me surprisingly well other than a couple of them that were a little bit snug and I'm still going to be showing those on camera I just covered them up with like beach towels and stuff that I also got from Zoffel.com so we're gonna start off with this swimsuit right here it's bright orange but it also has other colors like in the stitching which I thought was super cute it's a two-piece and what I did with the top was I actually strapped it in the front because that made me feel like it was a little bit more secure on my body again it's totally up to preference however you like it and keep in mind that all these swimsuits do have different colors you can get them in and shout out to my band-aid that is showing in like every clip just saying, I'm sorry about that. Uh, we're gonna move on to this bikini. This one, I really, really love the material of it. I used to play water polo and this kind of made me feel like it was a speedo type of feel. All the swimsuits that I got, they're not padded at all. They don't have any sort of push up or anything like that. But if you do like that kind of style, they have a bunch on Zoffel.com. So there's plenty to choose from, but yeah, this one, it's like my favorite colors and it's super easy. You just have to tie the top. You don't even tie the back. So I showed that in the clip. It's kind of like fish netty backings, like three little straps. So this purple one right here, it's again, another two piece and it's a little bit looser. So it doesn't show as much cleavage like at all. The back is pretty cool. The way it ties is just like, basically, I don't know what to call this, but if you can see, it's just, it looks like that on the back, which is, it's cool. It's cute. It's trendy. And then again, it has like little strappy things on the bottoms, which I personally really like. This swimsuit right here, it kind of reminds me of a triangle bikini. I don't know the names for these swimsuits at all, by the way. I do have them all individually linked though, because again, like I said, they have so many swimsuits. So if you want to find these ones, you usually can through those links, but it's mostly white. And it just has a really clean sort of look because it's not too skimpy. Like it covers your entire butt, which is nice once in a while if you're not tanning or whatever to actually have your butt like fully covered in a swimsuit. So I really like that one. This one right here, I'm gonna be honest, is my least favorite just because I felt like the fabric wasn't as thick. I'm gonna be honest in all these swimsuits, like which ones I really liked and which ones I didn't as much. But again, it's totally your style, your preference of like what you like when swimming. But I just felt like it was sort of a cloth material, but I really fell in love with the the print of it that's why I got it in the first place but as you can see it's not super supportive at all so if you are a little bit on the bigger size with your chest I would not recommend that this swimsuit is definitely one of my favorites again it's sort of like the speedo type of feel and it looks like cotton candy which I thought was really funny <laughs> it's sort of like a high-waisted bottom which is the strappies on the sides of your like hips but I thought it was cute and I liked it a lot. It might give you some weird tan lines in the back, but that's okay, well worth it. This swimsuit, I typically don't wear swimsuits like this, but I wanted to give it a shot because YOLO, it was like 15 bucks. It's a two piece, but it's high waisted. I don't really know what to call the style, but it almost looks like actual clothing, like shorts and then a tank top and it just shows a little bit of your midriff. But I thought it was cool, it was cute. Maybe if you wanna cover up a little bit more of your stomach. This one right here, here it's sort of like a mermaid top it's actually strapless but it comes with the straps which I think is really great because I don't like strapless bikinis I can't do it because I just can't it'll it'll fall down so 
you can easily strap on the top like so and then again it comes in other colors the bottoms i thought were so cute they remind me of la or florida or something just the palm trees and everything this right here is one of the two different one pieces i ordered from them it says mermaid day off which i just thought it was cute i don't know and i love the color blue i don't know once in a while like you never know when you may need a one piece i remember when i used to go to summer camp you weren't allowed to wear a two piece so Never hurts to have one of these, especially because it's that cheap. And this actually even looks like a rave one piece if it didn't say mermaid on it. And this is the same sort of thing. Personally, I like the fit from the blue one a lot better than the red one, but I thought this was cute just because it said like Baywatch on it. Don't even really know what that means, but I just thought it was funny. I like when some suits say stuff like that on them if they're one pieces because it makes it a little bit less boring. These last couple of swimsuits that I tried on for you guys, I tried them on with towels and tapestries or tapestries. I don't know how to pronounce it. Whatever. You guys know I have a bunch of tapestries in my house. I have one right there. I have one in my other room and I'm probably going to hang up one of these on my other wall in my kitchen because it's so cute. It's a towel tapestry rug. I don't know. It doubles over as like all three of those things, but the tops, they just didn't fit because of how much was shown in the middle. If you are a little bit less busty, I would definitely recommend these because they're so cute and I've never seen them anywhere else but I always see people wearing these types of swimsuits and tank tops so yeah I'm really disappointed that these didn't fit but that's my fault for ordering a medium so I might go back and order a bigger sized one because so cute again none of these have padding in them the ones that I'm showing you guys today but you easily could get your own padding and put it in because it does have an area where you could like do that and they have a ton that actually are pushed up on their website as well thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up and comment below if you'd like to see more hauls in the future follow my social media if you want to be friends outside of youtube i really hope you guys appreciate me trying these on on camera because one it takes forever two i'm really putting myself out there doing that and three i know that it will give you a more accurate representation of what they look like versus some model on the website in a picture where she's just posing so yeah, this was my first try on haul. Let me know what you guys think and don't forget to subscribe as well as subscribe to 7 Days of Slay, my collab channel. Link in the description where I upload every single Friday. I'll see you guys next time. Later alligators. Bye.